Hello and welcome to our channel. In today's video, we are going to talk about fascinating space facts that you probably didn't know. The Great Red Spot on Jupiter has been a significant feature of the planet for over 350 years. It's considered as a persistent high-pressure region that induces an anticyclonic storm, which has lasted for centuries. The Great Red Spot, without a doubt, is a massive storm that is even larger than the planet Earth. It is an active oval storm that rotates counterclockwise in the southern hemisphere of Jupiter, with wind speeds surpassing that of terrestrial hurricanes. The storm's upper winds are confined to the weather layer, and the vortex beneath is believed to have subsumed a considerable number of smaller storms. Despite the excitement, the future of the Great Red Spot remains a mystery, and scientists have yet to decipher its evolution fully. The Milky Way Galaxy, the spiral galaxy that contains our solar system, is a vast collection of stars, gas, and dust. With an estimated mass of about 1 trillion suns, it is one of the largest objects in the universe. To put this into perspective, this mass is equivalent to 5.97 by 1042 kilograms, an incomprehensible number for most of us. This massive amount of matter creates a powerful gravitational force that binds the Milky Way's stars and planets in their orbits. Scientists are still investigating the mysteries of this enormous galaxy and learning more about its behavior and evolution over time. The pillars of creation are truly remarkable structures. These columns of gas and dust located in the Eagle Nebula are formed by ultraviolet light and the strong winds produced by nearby stars. The fascinating thing about the pillars of creation is their immense size, as they are so massive that they would easily stretch from the sun all the way beyond Pluto if they were situated within our own solar system. Despite the harsh conditions that shape them, these pillars have remained a breathtaking sight for astronomers and space enthusiasts alike constantly reminding us of the vast beauty that exists within our universe. The close encounter with a minor galaxy has caused the Tadpole Galaxy to be distorted in a unique way that has fascinated astronomers for years. The long and almost ethereal tail-like structure stretching out from the main spiral galaxy has been created by gravitational tides. The gravitational forces that exist between the two galaxies pull on one another, creating a rippling effect along the outer edges of the Tadpole Galaxy, resulting in the formation of the distinctively shaped structure. While these cosmic events are rare, the Tadpole Galaxy serves as a shining example of the spectacular and sometimes unpredictable nature of the universe we inhabit. The vastness of interstellar space is mind-boggling, and it presents a daunting challenge to even the best technology we possess. Our current technology is not advanced enough to travel to the nearest star system, Alpha Centauri, which is a full 4.37 light-years away from Earth. Such a journey would require tens of thousands of years, making it virtually impossible using our current means. Perhaps in the future, with the advancement of technology, Humans will be able to explore the depths of space more comfortably, but for now, we are limited to studying and observing from a distance. The Kuiper Belt was named after Dutch-American astronomer Gerard Kuiper, who predicted its existence in 1951. This disc-shaped region comprises millions of icy bodies and stretches from approximately 30 to 50 astronomical units away from the Sun. It's believed that these icy bodies formed early in the history of the solar system and have remained relatively unchanged since then. Some of the objects in the Kuiper belt occasionally make their way into the inner solar system, becoming visible as comets. Additionally, the Kuiper belt is home to many dwarf planets, including Pluto, Eris, and Makemake. The study of this distant region has become an increasingly important area of research in recent years, as it provides a window into the early conditions and evolution of our solar system. When something enters a black hole, it's believed to be lost forever, 
sucked into the singularity at the center. However, the question arises, what happens to the information about that object? This mystery is known as the black hole paradox. Does the information about the object disappear with it? Or does it somehow persist within the black hole? The answer to this paradox has long eluded scientists, and many theories have been proposed to try and solve it. Some theories suggest that the information is irretrievably lost, while others propose that it is encoded in the black hole's radiation. The true answer to the black hole paradox remains one of the greatest unsolved mysteries in astrophysics. Did you know that outer space isn't a perfect vacuum? This fact was first discovered by scientists in the mid-19th century when they observed that the pressure of light in a vacuum was slightly higher than what could be predicted. Further studies revealed that even in the vast empty stretches between stars and galaxies, there are still a few particles known as cosmic dust. Are made up of tiny fragments of rock and metal that have been ejected from comets, asteroids, and even other planets. In addition to cosmic dust, Outer space also contains radiation, magnetic fields, and other forms of energy that scientists are still working to understand. The study of these phenomena is crucial to our understanding of the universe and our place within it. The sun's massive energy production comes from nuclear fusion reactions happening within its core. These reactions fuse hydrogen atoms into helium atoms, releasing a tremendous amount of energy in the process. This process of energy production is so efficient can continue to burn for billions of years. The energy that the sun produces not only fuels life on Earth but also has critical implications for fields like astronomy, astrophysics, and space exploration. Understanding the processes that produce the sun's energy is vital to unlocking the mysteries of the universe. The Orion Nebula, also known as Messier 42, located south of Orion's belt in the night sky, is a vast star-forming region that has fascinated astronomers for centuries. It is one of the brightest nebulae in the sky, and it is visible to the naked eye from Earth. The Orion Nebula is not just any nebula, it is a stellar nursery, where new stars are born, and some of them are even detectable using telescopes. The nebula is of great importance to astronomers as it provides an insight into the early stages of star formation and evolution. As a result, it is one of the most extensively studied objects in the sky, with ongoing research exploring every aspect of this magnificent sight. The Helix Nebula, also known as NGC 7293, is a well-known planetary nebula located in the constellation Aquarius. This complex, beautiful structure was formed when a star similar to our Sun exhausted most of its fuel and began to eject its outer layers into space. Over time, the star's core continued to collapse until it became a white dwarf, which can be seen at the center of the nebula. The Helix Nebula's distinct appearance has earned it the moniker, the Eye of God, owing to its to a giant eye staring back at us from space. The combination of its mesmerizing shape and origin story make it a fascinating subject for astronomers and space enthusiasts alike. Mars has been a topic of fascination for scientists and space enthusiasts for decades. It is one of the planets in the solar system that has been extensively studied by space agencies like NASA, ESA, and ISRO. The interest in Mars's potential for life stems from the planet's attributes that make it habitable. The presence of water, even if it is in the form of ice, is a good indicator of a planet's habitability. Mars has vast underground water reserves, and scientists believe that a subsurface ocean exists on the planet. The rocky terrain on Mars is also a factor that makes it a prime candidate for microbial life as certain extremophile organisms on Earth thrive in such conditions. Hence, the search for life on Mars is ongoing, and scientists continue to uncover new evidence that suggests that if life exists on another planet, it could very well be Mars. So that's it for today's video. We hope you enjoyed learning these fascinating space facts with us. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more amazing content like this. 
Until next time, goodbye.